finished at the market and now we are off to get some food we we're gonna go for brunch but because we've got the little baby we're gonna go get yum cha instead i have been assigned to go and see if there's any spots available fingers crossed there is We're at my grandparents, and look at that! Do you see the courgette? Whoa, mom, did you see this one? Whoa! That is the biggest courgette ever. What happened? <gasps> Yeah. <laughs> New city, new city, new women now. New weather, new leather, I'ma get it now. Test my patience for me. Hello, hello. So, I'm currently watching Harry Potter with tea. We are up to the Goblet of Fire. And we've been watching for a while, but I was just kind of in the mood to make some bread. I've only ever made bread once in my life, and we, that was when I was trying to make hot cross buns for tea in America. We're going to try and make Asian soft milk bread. It's got a very different texture to like normal white bread. It's much more, it's much softer, and when you rip it apart, it's, the inside is a bit more shreddy looking. It's so hard to explain. If you've had it, you've had it. 
you know what I'm talking about. Okay, I've just got all the dry ingredients, so I'm just gonna sift them in. I have mixed together the wet ingredients. It's just room temperature milk, butter, and one egg. I'm now gonna add in, this is like, it's called tonjang ru, basically just flour and water. I don't think it looks like the Japanese milk bread I was going for though. It totally worked. It's really fluffy on the inside. I think maybe next time I can bake it even longer so that the the crust is a little bit harder, but hey, not too bad, right? It's been a few hours and now it is dinner time. We got the Harry Potter We Are On Deathly Hallows Part 1. We're so close to finishing. And tonight I've got kumra and this is some corn, avocado, sausage and chicken. Guys, we're so close. After we finish this, we can finally watch the reunion. Good morning everyone! It is the weekend. I have had a super busy week, but it was so much fun. We even went on a field trip to somewhere called Kiwi Valley, which we basically got to like feed llamas, ride on horses, see ostriches on a tractor. It was very fun indeed and the kids loved it. Today we're going to my grandparents for lunch and since I haven't seen them in a while, I've baked them bread recently. I baked them the whole wheat bread. I've got a few ripe bananas so I thought I would make some banana bread. Ooh. <laughs> Why is it? Oh, turn on now. Oh. 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 Yeah. 
Yang bahasa tua Oh my gosh, that's so exciting. Whoa, sick. So we have a... Uh... <laughs> wow, new laptop. I'm gonna flip this over like a hamburger. Guys, look at all these fancy features on my new laptop. What did he say you can do? I think if you go here, name, you can, oh yeah, this was pretty cool. So all of these buttons, it changes the way the laptop is set out. How cool is that? This one's bright. Oh. No. Oh. This one is the brightness. Oh my gosh, it's so exciting. What else is there? Volume. Oh, how fun, sir. If you go into your notes and you type something, over here, you can change the boldness. Oh, and emojis. That is epic but yes i now have a new laptop this emoji thing is very cool <laughs> i love how you can slide and see the emojis now i can finally edit videos on this laptop without needing to carry a mouse in case i haven't mentioned it this is the 2020 macbook pro itch and i swapped it out for my other laptop which i've had for 10 years it's a very momentous time because that laptop has been with me everywhere when i moved to australia america traveled overseas to like hong kong anywhere else i've been bringing that laptop so <sighs> end of a decade so my parents just came back and they have bought a bunch of little desserts i thought i would share with you this is durian mochi mango mochi this is a soybean cupcake i've had it before it's really good and then this is yonzi gum lol which basically it's mango and sago drinks, but the cup is kind of cute. And then this is an epic chocolate Swiss roll. Guys, she looks epic. She looks like a magnum in a Swiss roll form. 